Good morning to you all. Morning, 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 morning. Happy New Week to you all, people. Welcome to Rhapsody of Realities. Today is Monday, 5th of February 2024. And today's topic is Tell It Everywhere. So before we start this beautiful morning, let's say prayer together. King of glory, we bless you. I am that I am. We give you all the praise. There is none like you in heaven and on earth. There is not to compare to you. It could only be you in our lives. Thank you for preservation. Thank you, Father, for divine health. For by your stripes we are healed. Thank you for this gathering this month because you made it possible. Thank you for sharing us into this brand new week. All that we needed, you have provided in abundance. For in Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. Praise the Lord, children of God. Welcome to Rhapsody of Realities. Today is Monday 5th. And today's topic is Tell It Everywhere. And he said unto them, Go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. He that believeth and is baptized shall be saved, but he that believeth not shall be damned. That's Mark 16, 15 to 16. In Psalm 67, verse 2, David passionately prayed to the Lord, Send us around the world with the news of your saving power and your internal plan for all mankind. David's prophetic desire is to be fulfilled in the words of the Master that we read in our opening verse. It's charged us to go into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. Tell the gospel story everywhere. Intensify your effort in teaching the lost, in telling the untold about Christ and his internal plan of salvation for all mankind. Only through him can men be saved and brought into God's class of being a realm of life. Until and unless a man is born again, his life will be empty and meaningless. Praise the Lord. But in Christ Jesus, anyone who believes is brought into oneness with God, into a life that is beyond the earthly plane. Praise the Lord. Where you are not limited by any factor or the element of this world. You become a partaker of the divine nature. Praise the Lord, no longer subject to sin, sickness, disease, and death because you receive the God life. That is the message He wants us to a heart to the world. Tell it everywhere that Jesus came, lived, died, and resurrected so that we may have His life and also be the dispenser of that life. Tell the nations and the fattest Island that He lives. And the life he brought us available to everyone. And this life is in his son. He that had the son had life. 1 John 5, 11 to 12. Be strengthened in your spirit and prepare to tell the world that the Lord Jesus has brought life and immortality to life through the gospel. Praise the Lord. And one who is born again received the same life with him. Glorious news. Let's tell it everywhere. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. What a way to start our week this morning. Are you, first of all, are you a born again Christian? And if you are, it is important that you spread the good news of the kingdom. Hallelujah. Tell everyone because you know the life you are enjoying in Christ. Because indeed it's a beautiful life. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. You enjoy joy unspeakable. Yes, you don't have the spirit of fear. You are comfortable knowing that trusting and knowing that God is able to do exceedingly abundantly. The life of Christ is indeed a sweet life, a life of rest. And that is why I'm here this morning to tell someone that Jesus is the only way. He's the only thing that can feed your heart. Jesus is the only thing that is not vanity. Praise the Lord. I tell that to myself. Sometimes I say, Jesus, you are the only thing that is not vanity. Praise the Lord. Jesus is the only thing that is not vanity. It's something that you have that you will never get tired of because it gives you this satisfaction and this joy. And if you're here, you've not given your life to Christ, sisters and brothers. There is no other way. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. There is no other way. 
Hallelujah. It said the way of Jesus. Hallelujah. He doesn't force you. He does not. Uh, uh, it's not like Satan that gives you. Um, that gives you and gives you command and if you don't live by that command you get punished praise the lord jesus is not like that god is not like that he, he gives you choice he gives you the free way praise the lord to test hallelujah and even if you fall in short it's still there waiting for you still helping you and still saving you there are so many things that, are, that would have happened to you that even though you were in the world God still protects you because that is how much God loves you and cares for you. And if you're here, you've not given your life to Christ. This is an opportunity for you to do so. All you have to do is repeat the prayer of salvation with me this morning. Oh Lord God, I believe with all my heart in Jesus Christ, Son of the living God. I believe He died for me and God raised Him from the dead. I believe He died for me and God raised Him from the dead. I believe he's alive today. I confess with my mouth that Jesus Christ is the Lord of my life from this day. Through him and in his name, I have everlasting life. I am born again. Thank you, Lord, for saving my soul. I am now a child of God. And if you repeat this prayer with me, congratulations to you. You are now a child of God. All you have to do is read your Bible. Get to know God. Get to know who Jesus is and who the Holy Spirit is to you. Bombard yourself with faith filled messages such like this. And look for a believing church and worship for growth. What a great time. And pastor is helping us, encouraging us. Be the part of the good news of the kingdom share it hallelujah share it praise the lord don't hold back share it if you're not preaching the word of god preach use what god has blessed you use that platform facebook is a free platform you don't need to pay use it for the gospel to propagate the gospel of the kingdom so that nobody will miss it hallelujah so with that being said let's take the prayer confessions dear lord thank you for the glorious light of the gospel 